My bride is Chris, and this will be our last video. In our last video, we went ahead and finished up as much as we could, but we need to go ahead and add these pagination links. That way, we go ahead and create a couple more uh, posts here. And I'll create another post, and I'll say, this is example post. Body is an example post or out the post and go ahead and create that post and we'll add another one, so four. So now we have four. We should have four. It's only showing three. Let's see. It's only showing three. Let's go in here and look into my HBI I'm in. I'm trying to overwrite one. Didn't take the other one. Mm. Anyways, so we want to have some kind of way to paginate. So to do this, first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a view, well, not a view, but the post links, and we're going to create a new view. So I think we're just going to grab this master that played that PHP with all these partials in it copy it, then I'm going to create a new file and call this one uh, just smaster for search master dot blade dot php and I'm just going to paste this in here and then just switch this back over to blade and save this and we're done with that This S master can be gotten rid of, the sidebar can get be gotten rid of, home controller, and inside this master, which is this master here, below the sidebar thing, we're going to say posts and then links. And that will give us, actually, we need to add that in there. So save that and that will give us our pagination inside our application so let's refresh and see and in fact it did not and the reason it did not is because if you look at the source the page source and we go down to this pagination here this how this is div class equals pagination that worked for la uh, bootstrap 2.3.2 it will not however work for bootstrap 3 so to fix this they've already built this in to Laravel so we're going to go in the app and then we're going to go into config and we're going to go to view and we're just going to append onto this slider thing a dash 3 like this save that go back in refresh and there we go we have our pagination now so we can paginate over and we can paginate back and paginate over and paginate back so there you go. So we have the pagination now set up in our blog application. Next we're going to go ahead and create, uh, actually use our Discus. So here's my Discus account. I'm just going to say for websites. If you don't have Discus, just go ahead and sign up for it. This adds a lot more functionality than I can ever describe into a tutorial. 
So I'm just going to say here Chris is good. And select the category. We'll just say entertainment and finish registration. And now it's going to tell me. We're sorry, sorry. As in use, Chris, let's try the A. And let's finish the registration. There we go. We're just going to grab the universal code. And I'm going to grab all of this right here. and inside our post.blade.php which is going to be here and go to post blade.php after this closing div tag here actually before this closing div tag because we want it inside of our container we're just going to paste this the code that you got from Discus, which is what I just got. Okay, let's go ahead and go back into Touch Bus and let's go ahead and refresh the home page and we'll say thank you for watching my tutorials. And here you can see your Discus comments are already ready, you're already posting, and you can equally share it on Facebook or Twitter. And then you can sign up and view your profile. And so most every blog now has Discus. And for somebody to actually just come in and going to start coding a blog or developing a blog, this is the best commenting system that you can use because it also it allows you to do so much and so much more than I could ever uh, explain in, in our tutorial. Now, when we get into our tutorial, our next premium tutorial, which is actually a photo sharing tutorial, then we'll go into comments because those will be commenting on actual objects. So, but as for this tutorial, this tutorial is done. I thank you for purchasing this tutorial. Uh, more free with tutorials will be on YouTube. And like I said, thank you very much.